New Jersey child has died from enterovirus D68, according to the local medical examiner. It is the first such ruling in this country. Even more surprising, the young boy was not symptomatic before his death. Wendy Gillette has more from New York. Health officials say the death of a four-year-old boy in New Jersey from enterovirus D68 is extremely rare. Eli Waller died last month in Hamilton Township after showing no typical signs of the virus. He went to bed with pink eye and never woke up. The idea of a very rapidly progressive death, you know, in, in one's sleep is um, surprising but not completely unanticipated. Uh, Enterovirus D68 is a respiratory illness that has sickened more than 500 people across the country, many of them children with pre-existing conditions such as asthma. Four other deaths nationwide have been linked to EV68, but it's not clear what role the virus played. Even though the respiratory virus E, uh, enterovirus 68 is quite common this year, it is mainly causing very mild illness and not this most um, horrific presentation that just occurred. Some children with the virus have also experienced paralysis in their limbs. But at this point, it's unclear if the polio-like symptoms are related to the virus or caused by something else. Health officials in New Jersey are also keeping an eye on another child in the same school as Eli. He's fighting a respiratory illness. Tests are pending to determine if he has enterovirus. Wendy Gillette for CBS News. The CDC recommends frequent hand washing, managing a child's asthma, and getting a flu shot as protective steps. Paula?